Well, the heat isn't stopping long-running camps from coming back bigger and better this summer. CBS 17's Lillian Donahue joins us live after visiting Camp Celebrate. And Lillian, this is a safe space for kids with burn injuries to get together. And this is a special year for Camp Celebrate. 40 years of empowering burn survivors. And although the pandemic has thrown a wrench in some of those plans over the past few years, campers I spoke with today said it feels good to get back to a little sense of normalcy. Now, Camp Celebrate is run by UNC's JC Burn Center. Usually brings kids in for the entire weekend to play games and connect. But the pandemic has forced this camp to scale down to just one day a year since 2020. This year, they've doubled the amount of campers they've hosted from last year to now with 50 campers. And today, the heat took top priority, especially because for many of the burn survivors, staying cool is a challenge depending on their injuries. They don't have the sweat glands to be able to sweat and to cool off naturally. So um, that presents a challenge. Um, so we have to make sure we're keeping them hydrated. And another change this year, they did drop their mask mandate here at Camp Celebrate, but all staff and volunteers had to be fully vaccinated. Reporting live in Wake, in, in Wake County, Lillian Donahue, CBS 17 News.